Welcome back guys. Um, today we're going to be doing another video. I know it's been a while because I just haven't been feeling like making a video but today I do. So today we are going to be reviewing the Matthews Verdicts bow. I got it last uh, January I think. Either December or January. And so far I've, I've killed some deer with it and I really like it. It's a big difference compared to my old bow, the Diamond Infinite Edge. So stay tuned. All right, guys. Well, so there's the bow. So I'll I'll start off with like what I got on it right now, and then I'll say like more detailed stuff about it. So so what I got on it, I got a bee stinger stabilizer. I need to get another one for the back though, but maybe eventually I'll get that. But I got an HHA optimizer sight. That's a big difference over my old bow. But um, I can shoot up to like 91 or 92 yards with it. The sight tape right there. So that's pretty cool. Um, what else? So I got a Matthews rest on it right there. And then I got the quiver with it too. And all of this has like, so the bow itself, it's got all these harmonic dampening things right there. If it'll focus. Right there. Right there. Well, no, maybe that might not be one, but anyway, I know that's one right there. It's got stuff in the quiver. For I guess that's vibration stuff right there the monkey tail and so the bow it shoots really really quiet so this bow so, is so definitely the smoothest bow I've ever had it's really quiet like when I shot it at the at the target range in the store I just was like jaw dropping how smooth it was and quiet but uh like there's no vibrations at all and if I can remember the specs I'll share them but um it, this is a 70 pound bow and it shoots between the 340 I think to 3 it's around that area around the 340 something range Oh, so as I was saying, around the 340 something feet per second area, 350, I was pretty close. It's 343 feet per second, but it's a 30 inch axle to axle bow. And I can comfortably bring it in a deer stand. And um, it's got a 6 inch brace height. Uh, it's a 26 to a 30 and a half inch draw length. So that, that makes a pretty good range for... I don't know for bigger guys and stuff taller guys and shorter guys like me because I'm only like 5'8", five, 5'9", five, but uh, it it also has an 80 or an 85 percent let off and it weighs about I think just over four and a half pounds it's not too bad but it's definitely heavier than my old bow but uh, yeah I like it so maybe y'all need to go get one Thanks for watching. It might not have been the most entertaining this video, but if that's a word. But uh, I'm just trying to get a video out there since it's been a while. and I just like this bow, so I was wanting to share it with y'all. And I'm not sponsored. I wish I was, but thanks for watching. And subscribe and like this video.